News Talk 1073 FM and 750 AM KOAL. Castle Country Local News starts now. Aiden Mortensen here with Castle Country Radio, and I'm here at Electric Lake in Huntington Canyon, where today in a collaborative effort between the Utah Division of Natural Resources and Utah State University Eastern, both professionals and students alike, are getting the opportunity to electrofish, something that will help measure the fish population density and health. In 2012, the Sealy Fire burned over 47,000 acres in Huntington Canyon. Heavy rain after the fire led to severe flash flooding and landslides, and several of those landslides drastically changed the flow of Huntington Creek. The amount of ash and sediment in the river after the fire resulted in a total loss of fish in the lower part of Huntington Creek. The creek has since been restocked, but biologists with the DWR have been consistently monitoring the population to make sure that the popular fly fishing location remains properly stocked with fish. So part of this is we're able to come out here and able to um, collect these fish, see the health and condition of these fish, um, able to see, get a population estimation, so then we know how healthy our fishery is being. This is done through electrofishing, where biologists place an electrode in the water, which stuns the fish long enough for them to be caught by biologists, and quickly measured, weighed, and counted to ensure the river isn't under or overpopulated. This is important for us to see that our, our fishery is doing healthy, and we're producing fish that, you know, people will want to catch and also that you know our fish aren't you know becoming too overpopulated meaning that you know that that could be a problem because they get stunted things like that um or that you know we need to adjust something in our management like hey we need to put more fish in or we need to do more habitat work um especially after the the fires we have been trying to pay attention to all this to see how our fishery is bouncing back from the fires that happened in 2012. As you can see, electrofishing is an important tool used by the Division of Natural Resources in order to maintain the health and density of the fish population in the Castle Country area. And for more Castle Country news stories like this one, you can visit our YouTube channel, KOAL Castle Country Focus, or you can go to castlecountryradio.com. And reporting for KOAL News, I'm Aiden Mortensen.